Lewis Hamilton joined Mercedes in 2013 and has since helped the team to World Championship glory. Lewis Hamilton's move to Mercedes can be heralded as nothing but a success in 2023 with six Drivers' Championship titles and eight Constructors' Championships under his belt. Rewind back to September 2012 and news of Hamilton's departure from boyhood team McLaren hit the headlines for the wrong reasons. Jensen Button claimed the move was not the right decision, within Martin Brundle stressing it was a gamble. Some doubters even expressed the deal was only down to money, a viewpoint quickly eradicated by Hamilton after winning his second title in 2014. However, with news of a new contract on the table to take Hamilton to 2024 and beyond, it's worth considering if he will ever walk away from the Silver Arrows. Hamilton has openly suggested he plans on enjoying a partnership with Mercedes even after his F1 exit. The 38-year-old said, I love that we have the long partnership we have. I feel like we are embarking on a lot of really positive things, not only in the sport but outside, and I think there's a lot of work to accomplish together. So I want to be a part of that. I think I'll always be with Mercedes, until the day I die. Mercedes boss Toto Wolff has also confirmed Hamilton would remain in the team once he decided to hang up his helmet. He said, he's much more than a driver to us now. And although we're not talking about a career end, it's also important to speak about his role as an ambassador for Mercedes and the many sponsors we have and the implication he can have in our wider universe. Wolf admitted Hamilton's new contract and future talks would be sorted out this winter. However, just weeks remain until the first race of the season while Hamilton recently hinted negotiations had not yet begun. Hamilton has previously expressed it was a dream to drive for one of F1's most iconic teams, Ferrari. Speaking to Sky Sports back in 2021, Hamilton said, It's definitely going to be crazy to think that I never drove for Ferrari. Of course, I look at the color and the red, it's just, it's still the red. I have a couple of Ferraris at home, so I do get to drive a Ferrari, just not the one. Charles Leclerc and Carlos Sainz are both only contracted until 2024 meaning a move could be possible. Back in 2020, Mercedes boss Toto Wolff accepted he could choose to secure the services of Leclerc if their package was still competitive. Red Bull boss Christian Horner has also admitted Hamilton had been keen to join Mercedes' arch rivals. Bernie Ecclestone has also corroborated that Hamilton came close to doing a deal with Red Bull but a move failed to materialize. Horner explained, Lewis and I have had a couple of conversations over the years, he admitted. From 2010 to 2013, he was very keen to come and drive for Red Bull, but we had Sebastian Vettel at that time and to have had two Alpha drivers wouldn't have made sense. Sergio Perez is out of contract at the end of 2024 meaning a move alongside Max Verstappen would be theoretically possible, albeit unlikely.